Hi, my name is Lyra Scout, and this is a brief Wikivids video about Ronald Fisher. Sir Ronald Aylmer Fisher, February 17, 1890 to July 29, 1962, was a British statistician and biologist who used mathematics to combine Mendelian genetics and natural selection. This contributed to the revival of Darwinism in the early 20th century revision of the theory of evolution known as the modern synthesis. From 1913 to 1919, Fisher worked as a statistician in the City of London and taught physics and math at a sequence of public schools, at the Thames Nautical Training College, and at Bradfield College. There he settled with his new bride, Eileen Guinness, with whom he had two sons and six daughters. In 1918 he published The Correlation Between Relatives on the Supposition of Mendelian Inheritance, in which he introduced the term variance and proposed its formal analysis. He put forward a genetics conceptual model showing that continuous variation among phenotypic traits measured by biostatisticians could be produced by the combined action of many discrete genes and thus be the result of Mendelian inheritance. This was the first step towards establishing population genetics and quantitative genetics, which demonstrated that natural selection could change allele frequencies in a population, resulting in reconciling its discontinuous nature with gradual evolution. Beginning in 1919, Fisher worked at the Rodhamsted Experimental Station for 14 years, where he analyzed its immense data from crop experiments since the 1840s, and developed the statistical technique known as Analysis of Variance, ANOVA. During his time at the Rodhamsted Experimental Station, Fisher established his reputation as a biostatistician, and became known as one of the three principal founders of population genetics. He outlined Fisher's principle, the Fisherian runaway and the sexy son theory of sexual selection. He also made important contributions to statistics, including the concept of maximum likelihood, fiducial inference, and the derivation of various sampling distributions, among many others. In 1925 Fisher published Statistical Methods for Research Workers, one of the 20th century's most influential books on statistical methods. Ten years later, he published The Design of Experiments which was also a fundamental work that promoted statistical techniques and applications. The mathematical justification of the methods described in this work was not stressed, and proofs were often barely sketched or omitted altogether. In this book Fisher also outlined the Lady Tasting Tea, now a famous design of a statistical randomized experiment that uses Fisher's exact test and is the original exposition of Fisher's notion of a null hypothesis. Fisher held strong views on race. Throughout his life, he was a prominent supporter of eugenics, an interest that led to his work on statistics and genetics. Notably, he was a dissenting voice in UNESCO's statement on the race question, insisting on racial differences. In 1957 Fisher emigrated to Australia, where he spent time as a senior research fellow at the Australian Commonwealth Scientific and Industrial Research Organization, CIRO, in Adelaide. He died there in 1962 and his remains were interred within St. Peter's Cathedral. Well my friends, I hope you've enjoyed this brief video about Ronald Fisher. Until next time, this has been Lyra Scout for Wikivids.